Hey everyone, out here at uh, Frog Lake, Mount Hood, Oregon. Gonna do a one night winter backpacking trip. Um, should be a good time. I am trying something new, pulling a sled. It's working pretty good so far. About halfway down to the lake. And uh, yeah, gonna try to do a little video of my experience. So I will, um, Check back in with you guys in a little bit. Well, just uh, found my spot, I think. Started clearing it out over here. Get right in between those trees and uh, I'll have a little bit of a view. Uh, it's gonna be pretty nice. I'll show you guys. There it is. Mount Hood from south side of Frog Lake. Pretty pretty amazing by myself right now but don't expect to be later since it is a holiday weekend there's my gear gonna mat down the area with the uh, snowshoes and then get going on some uh, tent action getting uh, camp set up here trying to at least slow going Snow's pretty deep. <clears throat> it's been so cold it hasn't like uh, melted and then froze to make it hard, you know. But uh, tent's pretty much up. I got space flattened out around camp. <sighs> a few more things. Let me get the fly on here in a few. But uh, dug out a little little area around the tent here in the front so easy to sit and get in and uh yeah i should have pretty good view from the tent sun is coming this way so i should get it within the next i don't know i'd say half hour to an hour so yep pretty sweet Got the fly on. Leave that side open for now. And, uh, put the rear vestibule open out there. Plenty of room for all the extra stuff. The uh, sled, the sled, <clears throat> the sled did really well. Um, I was really surprised. I did have a little incident right when I was pretty much getting here. My uh, bag loosened up from the uh, ropes and <clears throat> kind of slid towards the back. I had to stop and adjust it. But for the most part, it worked really well. I just uh, learned I need to tie it differently next time. So I'm going to wrap it around the uh, carabiners a little differently. Make it a little tighter. But yeah, this was working out real well so far. It's pretty much just been me today. There's one other group of people. It looked like they were going to be camping, but when they saw my good spot, they went uh, to a different area. So worked out well. And yeah, I think I'll probably end up making my little fire pit area right out here. We're pretty much right where my snowshoes are. And uh, we'll dig a little fire pit, a little uh, reflector wall. I brought a little bit of wood with me. I'm not going to take anything from here except for anything that's already down. I pulled a few branches that were dead that were, you know, hanging too low for my area here. But, yeah, got some wood. And I'm going to have probably maybe two hours tonight to enjoy the... Uh, warmth of the fire and then I got
plenty of layers in the sleeping in the uh, tent two sleeping bags just uh because i was taking the sled i had a bunch of extra room and yeah i'm gonna be real warm tonight not worried about it shovel worked out well lightweight um, does the job and my msr snowshoes are really sweet they're really light i don't even notice them really it's nice so yep came uh, out here to get some sun feels pretty good so it's probably 20 maybe 22 degrees or something camped over right behind me not sure if you guys can see it but yeah I only had to come out to here to get behind the tree get out of the trees to get some sun it's pretty nice and then uh, yeah airing out drying out the gloves a little bit <clears throat> and then uh, I got that behind me so I think I'm gonna snack on some food enjoy the view and then I don't know we'll see Almost five o'clock now. It's gonna be getting dark pretty quick here. Got a my little fire brought in. Just a couple pieces of wood. And I got a couple more. <coughs> That'll be nice. And then, uh, yeah, had some food and. <coughs> Got bed, everything set up. Got plenty of layers. Should be really warm. And yeah, it's gonna be gonna be a nice night. for the night I think time to get warm all right well just woke up <clears throat> it's uh, pretty cold I think my watch said it was got camp all wrapped up and getting ready to uh, make the trek back to the car but before I do I wanted to show you guys what I the setup I got going on <clears throat> so got a few carabiners running around the edges of the sled tied up with the uh, vinyl it's like a 
It's meant for like a boat, like a ship bag or something like that. And then got some PVC piping. That's Velcro in the middle just to hold them together. And then uh, got carabiners that hook just right to the belt loop of my pack. So, you know, I did some research online and everything and you know, this was a pretty popular design and worked really well on the way out and doesn't really, you know, carry a lot of weight. That bag's pretty heavy and it doesn't feel like you're doing much. So I like it. It was a good night. Definitely cold. Definitely tested out the winter gear, that's for sure. But Frog Lake was, was a really good time. So... Now for the walk back to the car. <clears throat> On the way back to the car, and uh, yeah, it's, it's really nice out. A few spots of the sun have uh, taken a break or two to warm up. And the uh, lake's looking pretty, pretty amazing right now. And yeah, it's nice. I'm going to take my time in no rush. Gonna enjoy it. Sled is pulling really well, actually. I tightened up my uh, hip belt and it seems to help secure it. Doesn't really feel like it's there even. So, yeah, working out well. <laughs> 